It's March 10th, 2020, and this morning, everyone on the MV World Odyssey got an email. Because of the coronavirus outbreak, the voyage has to end a month early. So we all have to get off the ship in Cape Town, South Africa, and we get there in two days. Honoring our commitment to Happy birthday, Gab! <laughs> We have today, tomorrow, and then two more. I don't know what makes me more sad, the fact that we can't travel or the fact that it's illegal. So, okay, that's, don't talk about that. Stop! Oh my god! I am so unwell. I'm so sad. I love you guys. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> Except that I a little less time with my girlfriend. Oh, with her. Oh, one's in the middle? <laughs> oh, this is a video. <laughs> Last night. Last night. So sad. This is horrible. We're all sad. <laughs> Cheers, baby. It's <laughs> our for people. <laughs> All pasta. We can get the bread rolls, that's bread roll time. I really tried to not like restrict myself, but I would go to fancy dinner and get like eight. <laughs> and then I would use one for the soup as well. So many people gave up bread rolls for Lent. That was like the thing to do for Lent. <laughs> Last big table. Lent! Hey guys! This is the last time I'm going to be filming in this room, unfortunately. 
Um, we disembarked from the ship today. The voyage did have to end early. But it's so empty, it's really sad. Like my roommate and I are packing our room right now and I think I'm gonna get off the ship in maybe like 20 minutes. But we are in Cape Town, South Africa, which is so exciting. This was one of the places that I was the most excited to go to. So I think it's gonna be super fun. My friends and I are all staying in a hotel tonight and I'm staying for about 10 days, I think. I'm gonna be doing um, like safaris. I think we might go skydiving. Right now, it's just kind of crazy. It's like pandemonium upstairs. People are packing, people are crying and like saying goodbye. It's like a very emotional day. So I'm just kind of trying to like decompress and get all my stuff done. I'm shipping a bag home and then I'm carrying the rest of it around with me. So I'm trying to finish packing and everything. Our room is so depressing. It's literally empty. Like there's nothing in here anymore. Like. Here's my roommate. Hi. <laughs> I'm so emo. This is my bed. I know. This was the comfiest bed in the world. Like, I feel like I'm not gonna be able to sleep with the ship not rocking anymore. I'm so used to it. Oh, I need to, I forgot, almost forgot. I'm literally forgetting everything. I cannot forget this. I got this painting in Mauritius and I do not wanna lose that because this is like one of my favorite things that I got. So that's kind of the plan for right now. It's a little crazy. But hopefully I'll be off the ship soon, which is really sad because the ship feels like home. I don't want to leave, but it's kind of the plan for right now. So we'll kind of see what happens for the rest of the day. Bye. <laughs> it's our home. It's a You'll always day. be our home. <laughs>
Megan, my friends are making fun of me. <laughs> I'm not doing this right. <laughs> I can't figure out how to work the toilet. They were hard to figure out. It's not. It's flush. It's like You pee and flush. <laughs> that breakfast was so dang. It was so good. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to do it! <laughs> We're going paragliding. I'm more scared than when I was going skydiving. I am pumped! <laughs> into great white shark cage diving i'm like really scared of sharks actually and i'm in the bathroom right now at the place and i'm like do i escape like or do i do it <laughs> Jack set off the alarm in our Airbnb at like 3.30 in the morning and the security guard came to check on us. And Robbie thought it was an intruder and grabbed this like charcuterie board thing to try and defend us. So 